Hi everyone and welcome to another video for the datingdirectory.co. Now today I want to chat to you single girls. Now these are the girls that actually go out on a nice night out, whether it's a Friday or a Saturday or whenever during the week, and you make it your main aim to actually try and hunt down a man or be on the prowl as they say. Now, it seems to be this consistent sort of trait that single girls have that um, are in and out of relationships or perhaps they find they just can't find a decent man is they tend to do these sort of things when they go out. And it's not good, let's face it, to go out and to just be continually on the hunt for a man or trying to find a date because it's going to do two things. One, it's either going to attract the wrong sort of guy who's only going to want you for a good time, not a long time, hence maybe a one night stand. And number two, it's going to repel the decent ones that actually want to be adding some value to your life. So here are three things to remember when you are going out on a night out. Number one, don't make finding a man your main sole aim of the night. You know, it's going to become very obvious in your words, in your actions, and what it's going to do is it's actually going to make you look a little bit desperate, and like I said, it's not going to attract the right sort of men. Number two, don't go bar hopping. Learn to be able to just be in one place, even if it doesn't have the array of men that you hope to be looking for, and learn to enjoy that moment and that space. Because if you're constantly going to be moving from one place to another, to another, to another, you'll have this whole air of restlessness and you won't actually enjoy the night as much or even be able to seize the right opportunities because you're already looking for the next one. And number three, focus on each other instead of the men around you. Now, come on, your girl time is important and being able to socialize and have fun is the main aim of why you should be wanting to go out, spending time with each other instead of looking to see what guy is there that you can chat up or what guy you can flirt with. I mean... At the end of the day, it is important, of course, to send the right signals to the right type of guys, but you don't want to be coming across like you are um, desperate and even unhappy with the company that you're with because men will be able to pick up on it. Well, there you go. I hope that helps you out. And uh, in the meantime, if you want to get any more advice, head to my blog, thedatingdirectory.co, and I'll see you next time. Bye.